This is a 9 TTK. I'm going to show, um, redid my 160 antenna. It came down in the storm, so I went ahead and redid the L network while I was at it. Uh, we'll start here at the choke. So that's um, two 17 turn chokes in series, RG400 coax, uh, 31 mix core. I get those from Palomar. And um, so I just made that choke there right at the L network. Here's the L. It's not the prettiest thing in the world, but uh, I did find I did have one doorknob capacitor laying around, so I used that. It's a thousand puff. I think Sim Smith wanted me to use about 1200, but it's uh, pretty close. So I uh, used what I had. Um, just got a piece of copper there with all my radial soldered to it and a piece of uh, copper braid that's tinned. And then I've got it ran over to a ground stake there that goes around the house. Here's the actual wire, that's a strain relief. Uh, this is in a, on a pipe. It's uh, down in concrete. I've had problems with this lifting up because the uh, antenna is actually between two trees. So follow the wire up there. Uh, it goes to a pulley, stainless steel pulley, goes through the pulley and then uh, goes over. And uh, see the top of that tree there, it terminates there. Uh, well, actually, right in the middle of the frame, you can see it. So, uh, from there, it goes through another pulley, and then it has a um, limestone block tied to the rope as a counterweight. So, uh, just tested it out, and uh, SWR is good between uh, well, about 1805 and 1900. Uh, gets around 2 to 1 at those two uh, areas.